so I have never ever shopped from Shein. Never have I ever shopped. Hello, hi, welcome to my channel. Welcome to Fashion Friday. Thank you so very much for watching this video. If you haven't clicked like, subscribe, or share. What's a girl gotta do? But if you're a Tony Savi, you're part of my family, you know, share me with yours. Don't forget to share me with some more. The goal is 200 subbies this month, and I'm sitting at 150, so hook a girl up. But thank you so very much, guys, for subscribing, for liking, for sharing. Wouldn't have it if you hadn't. So thank you. In today's fashion video, we are doing Fashion Friday video, correct? Fashion Friday video, we are shopping from Shein for the first time. Just as the thumbnail says, I have never shopped from Shein. And I've been seeing a lot of people shopping from Shein and I never find anything cute. So I'm hoping that I can shop a few looks and you guys maybe will hit the comment section and tell me which one I should actually buy. I'll put a few things in my cart. And yeah, so the delivery I checked is going to be on the 24th, but right now we are on a complete 24 hour shutdown for 20 days, so I'm not too sure when I'm going to get it. I don't mind waiting because I'm not in a hurry, but some of the stuff I do need, like the need a lot of sports bras, just a lot of lingerie stuff, just a little basic things, and I want some things to redo my apartment as well, like bedding and frames and storage boxes so that's what i'm mostly going to be shopping for and then we're going to head to aliexpress and hopefully get some hair i'm not going to buy anything from aliexpress as yet but i just want to see what they have and buy some hair because a girl looks like this right now and i'm not taking some of my hair anymore just need an upgrade i just need a closet change just some few changes here and there i want to redo my apartment so yeah, hopefully we get the stuff here and we can do the apartment makeover and have that room tour that I promised you, apartment tour that I promised you. I shouldn't make promises. But please don't forget to hit that notification bell if you want to see this awkward face again next week. And please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I need that. And the comment section, tell me which one is your favorite from Shein. If I do head on to it... I Spoiler alert, Aliexpress didn't happen. The shipping costs were just too ridiculous. Aliexpress just gave me a, some tips and tricks on which hair you liked and how I should style these looks. Hopefully, I will style them on camera soon. Thank you so very much for watching this video. Let's get into it. <laughs> so if you're a little unfamiliar with Shein, you'll usually find it in your app stores. Whatever phone you're using, it's in the app stores. Here is this page. What's usually here is a lot of ads on Ramadan as we are in the holy month of Ramadan right now in Kuwait. And apparently Shein is region specific. So a lot of the things that I find usually here are more on the Middle Eastern market than the things usually that I probably find in South Africa if I was there. So we head straight into my shopping bag and you'll see that I've already made a mess. But my first choice was this beautiful orange shoe. I'm not too fussy about where and how I get my shoes as long as they look cute. I love this heeled mule. I love orange. I love that embossed chunky heel style. The crocodile skin vibe. I could go on and on about the reason why this shoe belongs in my closet. But... I don't have an orange shoe, it's the best I can think of. <laughs> They have a pretty amazing variety of shoes. You just have to be very selective in your choices. I am a huge fan of Six in the City and this gives me major Carrie Bradshaw vibes. Like old me would buy this shoe without hesitation, but we're responsible. We're good with money now. <laughs> So one of the things that I really needed some advice on is this top. I saw it and I wanted it and then I realized that it was sold out and it was restocked and now I can't decide. Is it something that I need? Is it something that I just like? Is it a nice top? Is it gorgeous? Can I make it work? I'm just so confused. Hit the comment section. Tell me what you think. Should I or shouldn't I? I just don't know. <laughs> I need to make up my mind soon. 
I've been looking for very uh, aesthetic, cute elements for my apartment and this wall of paper was right up my alley. It's not a need, however, I think it could change the mood in my apartment right now. It could add some homely aesthetic. I've also been looking for these kind of quirky cushion covers for a very long time. I was even at the point where I was on interest and I was thinking of making my own, especially this facial expression one. I just love these. I'm a huge fan. And they're 1KD and 1KD is like oh, 50 bucks. So it's not too bad, I guess. So this bedding is right up my alley aesthetic wise. Love it. Perfect for an adult. However, sandstorms and my busy schedule, I'm not going to be able to maintain this. Nope. So those are the items in my basket. As you can see, some of them have already been sold out. But another thing that I loved about Shein is that if your things are sold out while you're still deciding, you can actually hit an option where they notify you when they're back in stock when they're restocked. So that is pretty cool. It's not a loss. If they restock, they'll let you know. Well, I'm a huge fan of this color coordinated set on your left. I saw it back at H&M a while ago. I spent a lot of time at H&M, I should know. Loved it, don't need it. I'm a very huge fan of co-ords. I think you can just do one print, one color, and then you're done. However, this set is too much leg, too much chest, too much arm for Kuwait. Still cute, but no. <laughs> Off shoulder, shoulder detail, asymmetric tops are a huge trend right now and I saw a whole lot of those, especially asymmetric. I just am not too sure if it's a trend that I want to follow. I feel like it's more of a fad and I don't know, I think maybe in a more classic top or classic color I'd be able to do it. Something like this but a little bit more classic. I also had a lot of graphic t-shirts in my basket but i saw a hack on youtube this past week that you can make your own graphic tees and i feel like yay because i'm not gonna spend this much money when i can just make my own prints what i've been looking for and yes if the hack goes well i will definitely share it with you if it doesn't please let me cry in peace Finally back from where we started from and we remembered where we are here. We're looking for some active wear, some lounge wear and some home stuff. So we head into the home wear section. They have a whole lot of cute stuff here. You have to be careful or you lose all your money. So after I killed all the real plants in my apartment, I have concluded that I'm undeserving of real plants and I'm going to go for fake plants, just something very basic and green. I need greenery always, we you know. They have really cute stuff, like the lighting blew my mind. I've spent a lot of time with the love of my life, Ikea, and a lot of money when I should have spent it on Shein, to be honest. Oh, once I finally got my act together, I type for what I'm looking for, which is wallpaper. Yeah. I just need something that will work as a backsplash in my kitchen, so anything with marble or brick will be perfect for the aesthetic that I am going for. The spoil one is actually perfect and functional, but aesthetics wise, I don't see it working in my kitchen. And then I found exactly what I was looking for, but it is sold out. Story of my life. This would have been perfect. Perfect. So we're gonna go with the brick one, I guess. And we went into the active waste section, the reason why we are here. 
to look for some sports bras i'm just looking for something that's very cute very functional and won't give me whiplash because my current sports bras have given me whiplash i don't even know if that's what you call it but i have the scars to prove it okay i have a very weird chest area very specific chest area so not everything that's cute works on me and vice versa so yeah this might be difficult but let's try it let's try it. it's only two and one kd your stuff right well that's the only things i'm buying <laughs> find something that looks like it will work here's a tip if you have a chest like mine go for something with a bigger strap and no thin straps because you're gonna need all the support you can get and what is nice about she in is that you have people in the comment section adding their experiences with the product and they gave this one a thumbs up My issue is that the ones with straps, they rub up against my collarbone and I do a lot of cardio and high intensity workouts, so that leaves a mark. So go for a lot of the T-bar style kind of bras, especially the kind that have more fabric around the chest. I think in my experience that works better. I think so. Good luck. <laughs> this one for example perfect soft material doesn't look like it's gonna burn my shoulders so into the basket that was easy right then a quick pop into the sales section it wouldn't be me shopping if I didn't go to the sales section we all know by now I'm a cheapskate say it with me <laughs> Like I said at the beginning a lot of the stuff is tailored to the Middle Eastern market so whatever I'm finding right now may not be the case for if, wherever it is that you are or it might be that this is the situation right now not everything is cool to my taste but there's some cute stuff here nothing for me in the sales section though but there is a dress that I need your advice on. This dress I've been seeing on a whole lot of uh, different hauls that I've been watching here on YouTube. I saw this print at Zara and then I was so shocked that this dress is actually from Shein. It is cute, way over my budget, still cute. Should I get it? Shouldn't I get it? I mean, look at that. It looks good on everyone. All body sizes a bit come on should i shouldn't i tell me what you think in the comment section then i went into my weakness blazers i don't really need to be wearing blazers but i love blazers especially this green one don't have a color like this in my closet also way above my budget also not a necessity but we're gonna put it into the basket and we will decide later on what do you think also needed some sleepwear just a few sets one or two and so we pop into the lingerie and pj section they have a whole lot of options but right now i'm just looking for some summer pjs something short maybe satin or cotton because say it with me kuwait is quite hot <laughs> They have a whole lot of different options, a whole lot of cute options. It was very difficult for me to choose. I actually don't even know what color I'm going for. I was just going to go for black, but I was digging this print that they had going on here, especially the navy with the floral prints. My vibe. Found one and went for these floral sets and this green set perfect for what i'm looking for right now i'm usually not a green person but i think this one is right up my alley love it yay we are done so it would have been highly unlikely that we would do shopping without buying a handbag that we don't need and this one is no different i've been looking for this bag for the longest time the style this color this wasn't 
supposed to be very easy but there's like six or five other colors here guys i don't know which one to take obviously i need the black but there's black there's the brown i'm loving the green oh my gosh i have a small problem i should see someone about this because handbags are my achilles heel or clothes are my key detail. Fashion is my key detail. Tell me what you think in the comment section. Which one should I take? And don't say them all because I cannot afford them all. minding my business headed to check out and i see a bottega well a full bottega still a bottega to me so cute i'm already seeing an outfit in this khaki color gotta have it please don't forget to hit the notification bell guys because a haul is definitely coming you know me by now and let me warn you if you take too much time your stuff will be sold out just look at my bag right now <laughs>